need to move money from place to place. The cost of doing so, the overhead, as you put it, makes me think, believe it or not, of Bitcoin, because some people have said, hey, Bitcoin is the answer to those problems. Are you a believer? Well, Bitcoin is exciting because it shows how cheap it can be. Uh, Bitcoin is, is better than currency in that uh, you don't have to ha be physically in the same place. And, of course, for large transactions, currency can, can get pretty inconvenient. The customers we're talking about aren't trying to be anonymous. You know, they're willing to be uh, known. So it, it, the Bitcoin technology is key, and you could add to it or you could build a similar technology uh, where there's enough attribution that people feel comfortable. This has nothing to do with uh, terrorism or uh, any type of, of money laundering. Well, Charlie and Warren have weighed in on Bitcoin. Do you own any? Uh, somebody gave me some for my birthday. Uh, and then a few years later, I thought, hey, I'm going to sell that. So no. Uh, there's some really good technology in terms of sharing databases and verifying transactions uh, that is talked about as blockchain. That is a good thing. Bitcoin and ICOs, I agree completely. Uh, it's one of the crazier speculative things where it's not, as, a, as a, an asset class, you're not producing anything. Uh, and so you shouldn't expect it to go up. Uh, it's, it's kind of a pure greater fool theory type uh, investment. Um, so, you know, I, I, I agree, I would, I would short it if there was an easy way to do it. So ask Gates where he lands on the topic we talk about virtually every day on this program, Bitcoin, and how he thinks about the cryptocurrency in the context of climate change, seeing as how Bitcoin takes enormous amounts of energy to digitally mine. I don't own Bitcoin, I'm not short Bitcoin, uh, you know, so I've taken a neutral view. I do think, you know, moving money into a more digital form uh, and getting transaction costs down, that's something our the Gates Foundation does in developing countries. Uh, but there we do it so that you can reverse the transactions, so you have total visibility of who's uh, doing what, so it's not about tax avoidance or illegal activity. Uh, but, you know, Bitcoin can go up and down, you know, just based on the mania or, or whatever the views are. And I, you know, I don't have a way of predicting uh, how that will progress. Um, now that said, I, I'm, I'm, I'm curious for your thoughts here because Tesla could potentially make more money from its Bitcoin investment this year than profits from electric cars in all of 2020. What's your take on that? What What's your Bitcoin take? And, and the fact that the price can just go up or down based on a simple tweet from him. Well, look, Elon has tons of money and he's very sophisticated. So, you know, I'm, I don't worry that, uh, you know, his Bitcoin will sort of randomly go up or down. I do think people get bought into these manias who may not have as much money to spare. So I'm not uh, bullish on Bitcoin. And, you know, I, my general thought would be uh, that, you know, if you have less money than Elon, you should probably uh, watch out.